This is MDMA, also known as Molly, Ecstasy, Pinger, and many other names. Often coming in pill or crystallised form, it is used up and down the country by many young adults and teenagers. Increased use of MDMA. Increased use? Fuck me. One more time. One more time, one more time. We got it, we got it, we got it. Ready? Set. Action. This is Tom. A first time user, on the sofa, at a party, alone. He's about to take the pill. Anxiety starts to kick in. Tom's eyes are wide. He doesn't know many people at the party, and the bloke who sold him the pill is wearing a blur top. How can he be trusted? Tom's heart rate excels as he knows a decision must be made soon. Stage one, anxiety. The average pill takes 20 minutes to kick in. As Tom looks around to find his friends, every thought rushes through his head. Until he settles on one, the dodgy pill. It's one that passes through everyone's mind when high. What if it's a bad one and he has to go to hostel? What if he has a seizure? How would his parents find out? The thought eats you alive as panic starts to set in. But Tom is lucky tonight. Stage two. Tom starts to feel euphoric. The music is deeper, the lights are brighter, and the people look better. His pupils are dilated, his jaw is clenched, and his heart rate has slowed down. Tom is in the honeymoon phase. Everything he sees and touches is wonderful. He no longer cares where his friends are, Tom's lost in the abyss. Doesn't sound too bad. But it's all an illusion. And you kids should remember that. It's a little patronising though. Stage three, love. Tom has an overwhelming feeling of love. Unlike our legal and much more suitable choice of consumption, alcohol, it doesn't make you aggressive. MDMA makes you love people. Everyone is now his friend. His dopamine receptors are off the charts. He's completely forgotten about his friends. Everyone around him is now his friend. Tom has never been so calm. Nothing can defeat this moment. He'll remember this for the rest of his life. A story he would tell people forever. Once he is sober, he still will never be the same. Tom is in a complete state of bliss. As I'm told to remind you, listen to us, this is bad. Don't do it. Unlike alcohol, Tom has no hangover, no come down, no feelings of anxiety or depression. Tom is perfectly fine and... Uh, Wait, uh, I'm sorry, really? Is this, is this it? A whole team of writers, and that's the best we can come up with. I mean, I can't see the problem. If anything, you describe a good night out. I... You won't get paid for this.